Hello, this is Paul from QuickenMobile.com and we are here with the Megatron Automatically Folding and Unfolding Mobility Scooter and this video is all about batteries, how to charge them, how to use them, and what is travel compliant and what is not travel compliant. So the first thing I would like to do is just take a look at the actual scooter. Now the scooter is folded up and when you take the scooter out of the box, the battery may be slightly out of the scooter. So the first thing that you want to do is make certain that the battery is flush into the scooter. And we've made other videos about this. So you may wish to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so because we do lots of videos. Or you could look on quickandmobile.com. We have a lot of information on our website about the Megatron and you can give us a telephone call as well. We are very happy to be a United States company with United States reps. So we'll go ahead and unfold the scooter. I'm going to do this with the key fob. We have made other videos about how to unfold and fold the scooter, so I'm not going to go over that in this particular video, but I will point out there are two ways to charge the scooter. Let me just make a quick adjustment here so this is easier for me to grab. And we'll go ahead and take a look in the back of the scooter. So the back of the scooter here, we have a charging port and I will go ahead and plug this charger in to the charging port so we can see that we have the universal standard three prong charger. You can see the arrow on the top. So we will go ahead and plug that in and I will plug that into the wall here and you'll see that that turns red and there's a slight fan that keeps it cool. So when that turns green, the scooter is going to be charged up entirely. So we'll go ahead and unplug this just for now. And we will take a look over here at the actual battery itself. Now, I do want to point out that it comes with the battery and we give you a second battery completely free. So we don't charge you for a second battery. We give you a second battery free. And I also want to point out 24 volt 6AH battery. So you know what that means? That means that this is a travel compliant battery. If it's a 10AH battery or 12AH battery, guess what it's not. If you guessed travel compliant, you guessed right. And I won't mention any names, but there are companies that will say their devices are travel compliant that do not give you travel compliant batteries. And can you imagine what a problem that would become when you are at the airport and learn, uh-oh, somebody didn't tell me the truth, now I'm stuck. We don't do that. So there's a couple ways to actually charge the batteries as well. The battery just lifts right out of the scooter. And you can see that there's a charging port and you can see that there's terminals in the battery. And you can see the terminals right here. So it's very simple to put the battery actually into the scooter. just kind of clicks right into place, but we'll take a look at the actual spare battery because a lot of people want to know, can I charge the battery outside of the device? I want to leave the device maybe in my garage or somewhere separate from the battery, and I want to charge the battery off board. Yes, you absolutely can. This is on the side here. I just plug that right directly into the battery and this battery is full, so it doesn't need to be charged. So if we go ahead and take a look at the other battery here, we will plug this in, and we can see that that is actually charging the battery. So that turns red when it's charging the battery, green when the battery is full, and don't get snookered, folks. We give you two travel-safe batteries. Thank you so much for watching.